When we look up at the sky at night from Earth, we are witnesses to a spectacular show that we have absolutely no idea as to what it means or what is happening. Are we even a part of this celestial display that is seemingly never ending? Or are we just a fluke that has the privilege to enjoy this grand gesture? What does it all mean? Does it just mean nothing? Surely not. And how far out does this almighty cosmos stretch? Where does it end? It must end somewhere, right? And what is at the other side of the universe? The universe can't just be one massive thing with nothing else around it. Just like the earth is surrounded, so must the universe. Wait till you hear this. Astronomers think space outside of the observable universe might be an infinite expanse of what we see in the cosmos around us, distributed pretty much the same as it is in the observable universe. This seems logical. After all, it doesn't make sense that one section of the universe would be different than what we see around us. And who can envision a universe that has an end? We can't see it or even comprehend its size, but we know for sure there must be something else around it. So the observable universe is basically the area of space where light has had enough time to travel to the Earth for us to see it through all those big telescopes we have. The other part which we cannot see is so old and far away that the light from the unobservable universe has either simply dissipated, vanished, or no longer exists and has already traveled past the Earth and will be visible somewhere else billions of light years in the opposite direction. The universe has no detectable end and no detectable size. So you would have to wonder why we even ponder this question. Well, why can't we understand the beginning of everything before the universe existed? But there has got to be an answer to these questions. Could every single possible scenario imaginable all be taking place at the same time? And get this, flat earth theorists are going to love this one. Astronomers all agree the universe is flat. I mean, come on guys. Talk about throwing fuel on the fire. Many experts around the world, including Stephen Hawking, has said this is a question within a question with no answer inside because it is beyond human understanding. And even if some alien race who knew the answer to this question, we still probably would either not believe or understand them. Crazy, right? So just like the universe is made up of planets that are all different Maybe the great beyond is made up of multiverses that are all freakishly different. The universe that we are in is just one universe in an even bigger area where there are bigger and smaller universes than our own. We don't know what to call this, so we are naming it the great beyond. The theory obviously suggests that there are borders between universes where one begins and the other ends. Perhaps universes are just bubbles floating about, bouncing harmlessly off of one another. Everything within the universe is just one big coincidence, including the Earth. And if you try to go from one universe to another, you may pop it. Just a thought, guys. Perhaps going through the black holes are the gateways through our universe into another universe. Maybe that is the gateway. You never know. What the universe is how it was created and why it's here along with us is an impossible question that obviously can't be answered anytime soon perhaps the answer to this vast cosmos is on the earth maybe everything exists for the earth and the life that is teeming freely here or maybe there is just nothing when humanity dies the life within our body will remain part of this universe so in this sense we never really die. We are part of the bigger picture. Something like that anyway. What do you guys think lies beyond the universe we are in? There are plenty of theories flying about out there. What are your thoughts? Comments below. Thanks for watching.